Christie on Facebook is asking um, Senator Stabenow how there can be more funding for Medicare, Medicaid services that relate to Absolutely. mental health. Well, thank you for the question. And uh, I would say this, we're, we are working on two fronts right now, even though I've said that grants are um, you know, not where we want to go until we can get the full funding uh, and reimbursements. We are increasing grant money. There's a community mental health block grant that we've increased. We've added also 500 million more to the VA for veterans, which is another important group of folks that we need to be uh, making it okay to ask for uh, mental health help. And so we have been increasing. We've added another billion dollars this year for opioid treatment, which is another piece of this. We talk about diseases in the brain, Doctor, as you know, it's mental illness. It's also addiction changes your brain. And so these are, uh, these are illnesses in the brain that we need to be addressing. But in the long run, and it's hopefully not too long, <laughs> we're in the middle of this now, um, we have to decide that we are going to fully fund behavioral health services, mental health and addiction, like we do physical health. So when you go in the emergency room, you are able to get mm -hmm. care, um, but we want you to be able to go to a community mental health facility to a 24-hour emergency facility uh, that focuses on mental health and addiction and for it to be fully funded with the professionals there and the access to treatment and medications. And so we're, we're beginning that process right now. I mean, we we have eight states that we have now fully funded to do that and now we're working to expand that out. And in the long run, I truly 